time for you, is it? Come on, I've still got a business to run. I should have told him to go. Yeah, but it's me you want him rid of, innit? Well, I just needed some space to get my head round to figure out what I'm going to do. I mean, surely you can understand that. It is a big deal. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I am part of it. Well, obviously. To a point. Well, I'm the dad. Do, do I not get a say? What, in which clinic I go to? What? Well, that's what you want, isn't it? How would you know? You haven't even asked me. You've told me you're pregnant and then you shut me out. I'm not trying to. Well, it sounds to me like you made some pretty big decisions without me. Hang on. Are you saying you want to keep it? I don't know. It's not like looking after Jack, just now and then. It's hard work. So you think we should get rid? I think we should be realistic. And I've already got three grown-up kids. Not sure I could go through all that again. The nappies, the sleepless nights, the never having a single second to yourself. And who's going to run the farm? It has to be an option. I need a table, please. I'll go. No, no, no. See ya. No, we're in the middle of something here. And I need to do the accounts. Then go and do it somewhere else. Fine. I'll just um, check on the kids if that's right with you. Next week I'll be 42. Which means by the time it's Adam's age, I'll be 63. That's no age these days. It is if you spent most of your life bringing them up. At least you've had a chance. We haven't even been together that long. Now we're getting there. <laughs> what? You think I'm going to do a bunk, don't you? You think I'm going to leave you to cope on your own? No. Then why say it? Because I, I just want us to be able to enjoy ourselves. Not worry about being parents. I mean, have you really thought about it? About what Debbie thinks? It's nothing to do with her. Well, it affects her. And Sarah and Jack. Yeah, all right, I get it. It's not going to be easy. But it's different for you. I've never been a proper dad. Didn't even know Debbie existed till she was 13. Having another baby's not going to solve anything. I've messed up with her. No, you haven't. Where she's going, I have. This is my chance to get it right. Probably my last chance. <sighs> He's gone back off. I know you're worried, but we make a good team. It's not enough. If this happened a year ago, what I'm trying to say is, I've changed. I can do this now. You think you can. Big difference. Hey, I thought you were going to be angry. I wasn't expecting all of this. What, they might actually have feelings? No, don't be stupid. Well, no, that's what you think of me, isn't it? Not denying it, then. Lose the self-pity game. Hey, if we are arguing now, what do you think we're going to be like with two hours sleep of a night? It's not going to be like that forever. Long enough. And it doesn't get any easier. Well, it can't be all bad, because you wouldn't have had three. I was young, and 20-odd years makes a hell of a difference. We don't have to decide yet. Seems you already have. 